hello everyone this is neeraj yadav and again i am here with a new topic and today we learn that what is the dhcp relay feature and how you can configure it on router so let's do it i would like to tell you something that what i have already configured in this circuit in this circuit actually i have created two dhcp servers which is dhcp server a and which is dhcp server b so you can see it here this is ip dhcp pool a and this is ip dhcp pool b okay so i have created ip dhcp pool a for this network 192.168.1.0 especially for this network and uh, IP DHCP pool B for this network ok so now let's understand what is relay feature so when you configure DHCP server on this router so these pieces easily take the IPs from the DHCP server because these pieces are directly connected to the router there is just a switch between these two uh, PCs and routers but these pieces will not be able to take the ips from the dhcp server okay because the dhcp server is at here and the systems are in this network so if this router knows about this router also about this network also then also these pieces will not be able to get the ips from the dhcp server because uh, you know what that uh, whenever a pc send a request for the ip address then it will be broadcasted and as we all know that the broadcast messages are remains within the network the broadcast messages are do not go outside the network so what we will do we will go to this router and write a command on this router and what it will do it will send the broadcast messages of ip to this router okay so when the broadcast messages for the ip will go to this router then this router will send a reply to this router and this router will send that reply to these systems and these systems will get ip easily so let's go to this router which is router 2 as you can see here and configure the relay feature ok so basically what the relay feature do relay feature helps to take the IP by the DHCP server outside that particular network ok let's go to the fast ethernet 0 by 1 because as you can see here that the fast ethernet 0 by 1 is connected to 192 network ok so so after going to the configuration mode go to the fast ethernet 0 by 1 and the command is interface fast ethernet 0 by 1 this is the short form of that command so you can write it as it is also now write a command ip helper address okay and then give the IP that where you want to send the IP broadcast messages and the interface IP is 12.1 okay which is this interface ID so press enter now these systems will be able to get the IP from the DSCP server and the DHCP server is at this router so you can check it go to the IP configuration ok and here it's get the IP so go to this laptop also go to the IP configuration click on DHCP and it will get IP which is 192.168.2.3 and these IPs are coming from this router okay 
you can see here if we go a little upper then we will be able to see that IP DHCP pool B and network is this network 2.1 okay so this was the video that what is a relay feature and how a relay feature works so hope you like this video if you have any doubt regarding this relay feature topic then don't forget to comment me in the comment box and hope you guys like this video if you like this video then don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my videos and keep watching my videos for the networking updates database updates and more technical videos also okay so keep supporting and keep watching my videos see you in the next video bye bye see ya take care